Hi, I'm Justin Franks with Pro Computing, here to give you a quick overview of the mechanical usage of the Justan V2. Now, for the purposes of this video, I'm not going to talk about how to mirror your iPad to the projector. Uh, we're just going to talk about the mechanical functionality of the Justan V2. Uh, so, this is the Justan V2. Um, and this is the way it comes out of the box. It is a collapsible unit. You can fold it all the way down, which gives you ease of mobility. Um, so, whenever you first get it, you'd like to unfold it. You'll use this button down here on the base. Click that button, you can rotate it up, and that's how you unfold the Justan V2. Now in this unit, we used a pinch and squeeze functionality to uh, determine the position of the arm. So you'll use these two main buttons here and here, the two main big buttons on the main joint. You'll squeeze those and release at the desired angle. So wherever you let go, that's where it's going to stay. Okay. To insert your iPad, you're going to use this button on the end of the arm. So you'll push that with your thumb and slide. Okay. So we'll insert the iPad, push the button, and just push it together. Feel free to be a little bit rough with it. Uh, this should be very comfortable, very easy. Uh, if anything feels uh, hard, then something is wrong. Now keep in mind you can use it in landscape mode very quickly, turn it to portrait mode. It'll move, adjust all the way in to fit the iPad mini. Most Android devices and it'll fit just about any case, so don't think you need to take your iPad out of the case to put it in the Just Stand. Uh, as an example, I have an iPad that's in an OtterBox, very popular case. Just push it together and it fits great in landscape or portrait mode. Okay. So, let me put uh, the iPad in, hit the camera app, and it very quickly turns your iPad into a document camera. And now you can pinch and zoom, uh, however, on this unit we added uh, the ability to zoom optically. So you're able to adjust the iPad up and down the shaft. So that's this button back here, right next to the shaft, click that button and you can adjust down the shaft. So if you need to get down nice and close, maybe you're using a document that has small, fine text. Uh, as an example, I've got a business card here. It's got very small, fine text on it. You can get down nice and close, and it's very sharp. This is also very important for users that have an iPad 2 or some Android devices that have cameras that maybe aren't quite as sharp. And again, to adjust it back up, I'm going to use that same button and adjust it back up to the top. So that's how you move it along the shaft. So a lot of our customers were using the Just Stand as a uh, video conference center. Um, and so we wanted to give you the ability to rotate the iPad to the side. So we added a little lever right here next to the arm. You can rotate that out, let the iPad rest against that lever that makes it nice and secure. And we have a button on the side of the arm that gives you that extra axis. Push that button and you can rotate the iPad on the side. Uh, so now this is a very nice angle to use as a conferencing center uh, and I'll show you that. Let me just pull up a chair. And you can see it gives you a very nice place to do your video conferencing. If you've uh, ever done this before, or if you shot a video of yourself, or, a, or just a picture of yourself, you know uh, that that bottom-up angle uh, isn't very good. So you want a nice high angle to work from, and this gives you that position. So again, to rotate it back, we'll use that button on the side of the arm. Rotate it back. 
and I'll go ahead and move the lever away. We also had a lot of customers that were using the Just Stand as a tripod. So we wanted to take that all the way and add that functionality to the new unit. So to rotate it up to tripod mode, you use the pinch and release buttons on the main joint, squeeze both, and rotate it all the way up. This will give you a 90 degree angle and use the button that rotates it to the side on the arm to spin it around at a 360 degree angle. And this is how you can use your iPad as a video camera. So again, to rotate it back, use that button on the side of the arm and pinch and release to choose your desired angle. Now, if you did get the, uh, the Just Stand that has the electronics built in, you may or may not have that. It depends on if you ordered the, uh, the Just Stand V2 with electronics or without. If you got the unit that has the electronics, you'll have these little USB ports built into the base. There are two of them, one on each side, one here and one on the opposite side. These are high amperage USB ports, so they'll power just about any USB device. So you'll need to plug it in. We stayed away from batteries, so you've got a DC power that plugs right into the back. And uh, first I'll show you the uh, light accessory. So this is the flexible light. One of these comes with the electrical unit. Plug that in, and now you've got light uh, to illuminate your document. Uh, is, this is especially important if you're using it as a document camera in a dim or even a dark room. Now keep in mind that there is a little switch on the light, so if your light is off, you'll want to flip that switch and turn it on. So I'm just going to show you this. Uh, I'll put a document, zoom in a little bit, and uh, I'm just going to turn the lights out so you can see it uh, used in a dark room. Uh, so you can see, and I, I, don't, I don't know if you can tell with the video camera that we're using, um, but here I've got a bright image, it's a dark room, um, and, and uh, even in a dark room, I can use my iPad as a document camera. Uh, the image is bright and very sharp. In addition to the light, you can use the high amperage USB ports to charge your iPad. So I've got a charge cable. I'm going to plug that into the USB port in the base of the Just Stand. There we go. And so now we're fast charging. And so if you've used your iPad as a document camera before, you might know uh, that when you're using that camera app for a long period of time, it'll burn through the battery. Uh, so this is a nice way to be able to charge while you use your iPad as a document camera. So, that's the Just Stand V2. I hope you like it. If you have any questions or, feed, or feedback, feel free to visit us at iPadDocumentCamera.com. Keep in mind that you can fold your Just Stand all the way down and take it with you when you go. Thanks a lot.